today on Provost Park Pass, we're we'll talking all about Paradise Pier Hotel. Me and Goofy are going to be hanging out all day here. The Pacific Pier Hotel was built in 1984 by a Japanese corporation, and the name of the hotel was the Emerald Hotel. Then they changed the name from the. <laughs> One more time. Then they changed the name from the Emerald Hotel to the Pan Pacific Hotel. Then in 1995, Disney bought the hotel and changed it from the Pan Pacific name to the Disney Pacific Hotel. Then in the year 2000, Disney changed the name to the name that it's currently known as, as the Paradise Pier Hotel. So let's talk about the Paradise Pier by the numbers. It's the smallest of the three hotels on property. It only has 481 rooms. Pretty tiny for a Disney hotel. There are three restaurants, the Surfside Lounge, the Slurpin' USA, which is by the pool, and the PCH Grill. There are four elevators in the Pacific Pier Hotel. Three of them are internal, and one of them is a glass elevator. Elevator number D. Elevator number D. Number D. Number D. So if you're lucky to get that one, you have a nice little view. Lobby. Yeah! <laughs> That's awesome. The Pacific Pier Hotel stands at 15 stories high. When you stay at the Paradise Pier Hotel, you can get two different types of views. One is the park view, which is amazing, overlooks Disney California Adventure. The other is the pool view, overlooks the pool and the California Scream and Water Slide. California streaming water slide. <laughs> so the theme of the Pacific Pier Hotel is casual beach. Everything is supposed to represent having a fun day at the beach. The Paradise Pier Hotel is the only hotel that has a 13th floor. The other hotels have skipped that numbering because it's considered bad luck. But in Japanese culture, 13 is a very lucky number, so they've included it in this particular hotel. The elevators in the Pacific Pier Hotel are a little odd. There are no buttons to push inside the elevator. So what you do is you push the button of the floor you want to go to on the outside, then it points an arrow to tell you which elevator you should board. See? No buttons. So right behind me is one of my very favorite hidden Mickeys. It's more of a light illusion than anything. They have three bright lights aimed at this painting. And when you look at those lights through a camera lens, you can see the hidden Mickey. There's lots of little things that are fun for kids to do here at Paradise Pier Hotel. One of them is the Sandcastle Theater. The kids get to sit in little beachcomber chairs and watch classic Pixar films. <laughs> The Surfside Lounge is open from 6 a.m. to midnight. It offers pastries, coffee, little sandwiches and salads. It's a great place to grab a little quick bite to eat. This makes Paradise Pier very unique. It has the only restaurant where you can dine with none other than Mickey Mouse. I really enjoy this little water container. Every day we've stayed here, it's been different. We've had strawberry water, we've had orange water, and then we've had lemon water. It's those little perks that Disney does, right? Now, here's some real insider information. On July 10th, they're gonna be moving Mickey Mouse to the California Grand Hotel and having Donald Duck come here. So if you're staying here after July 10th, 2018, now you can have breakfast with Donald Duck. The Paradise Pier Hotel offers a 24-hour fitness center known as Mickey's Beach. The Paradise Pool is located on the third floor. It's amazing. It has a pool, a little splash area for kids, and a water slide known as the California Streamin'. For those of you who have little ones, they also have a little tiny kiddie pool right here. It's only one feet it's only one foot deep, one feet deep. It's only one foot. It's just one foot, that's one foot. Basically 12 inches of water is what I'm trying to say. Hey sir, that's a one foot pool. Oh, shoot. Thank you. Have a magical day in paradise. Every day at four o'clock right here at the pool, they have a pool party right here. They have a DJ, they play games, there's all kinds of music. And you're probably thinking, Chris, what's the age limit to a pool party? 
Well, 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 Disney has no age limit. Everybody's welcome to pool party. Sometimes traveling with little ones can be difficult. Disney tries to make it as easy as possible. Every single room here at the Paradise Pier Hotel has a pack and play in the closet. That's right, you don't even have to bring your pack and play. There's one provided for you in every single room. The true bonus of staying here at the Paradise Pier Hotel is the magic morning. That's right, they give you a bonus hour at the parks. Every other day it's gonna be at Disneyland, and then on the opposite days it'll be a Disney California Adventure. So make sure you use those bonus hours and don't let them go to waste because you basically get the park all to yourself. After you spend a long day at the park, you can come back to the hotel, and on Thursdays and Fridays nights at 9 o'clock, right here, they show a family movie, a Disney movie. They put a big screen up, you can sit down, watch a movie of snacks, and just kind of cuddle up with your family. It's a really great way to end the day. And that's how it's done, kids. Boom! What is your name? Kira. Kira, and who is your favorite Disney princess? Ariel. Ariel is a good one. My favorite character is Donald. My favorite character is Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear. All classic characters, everybody. Thank you so much for stopping by and saying hi. If you forget something, don't worry. You can shop at the Mickey in Paradise gift shop. I'm overloaded with Mickey. There's so much Mickey here. <laughs> Something that really makes the Pacific Pier Hotel stand apart from the other two sister hotels is the fireworks show. That's right, this is the only hotel that has a balcony dedicated to the fireworks show. They will even pump in the firework music and characters' voices so you can hear the whole show and watch it right here from the Pacific Pier Hotel on level number three. <laughs> I don't think I've told you yet. I just want you guys to know that I think you're awesome. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button right up here. I also have some other videos about the other hotels here at Disney California Adventure. And if you have any comments or suggestions for future videos, put it down in the comments down below. I want you guys to know that I think you're awesome. Have a great week. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.